I think most people assume that Canada has an IP policy. The fact is Canada really doesn't have an IP policy. Canada has a number of intellectual property laws, a copyright act that's actually now being uh, reviewed, and a patent act, a trademarks act, but that's not a policy. Those are laws we've had on the books for in many, uh, in some cases for decades. And um, w it's time now to ask that question, where do these laws fit in Canada's innovation policy? more broadly than just intellectual property. I think there's a recognition that intellectual property is part of that broader picture, that bigger picture of, of innovation. Um, to make matters actually worse, uh, if you look at uh, the policies that are in place in Canada now, there are federal policies, provincial policies, but even some of the larger cities have their own innovation type policies. Some of these actually uh, cancel each other out. Um, there's no comprehensive uh, understanding of how the system works. Uh, we don't really have metrics to determine whether the system works. And the problem is that innovation is not something we can um, ignore. Uh, if Canada is go going to create jobs in the next uh, decade and, or two, they will be innovation-related uh, jobs. For example, uh, people say, well, Canada has natural resources, uh, agriculture and forestry and so on. Uh, obviously, that's true, but even in those industries that develop natural resources, it's innovation-based. It's how efficient are you at producing the resource, at transforming the resource. Now, if you look at the more uh, uh, technology-based industries, uh, the, the video game industry, very strong in, in, in Montreal, for example, um, but all the, the technologies that are, are really uh, emerging, not just in Canada but around the world, how intellectual property protects those technologies, how it uh, becomes an incentive to innovate but not a burden on innovators, not something that will in fact slow down innovation because that also happens, is probably the most important question that as a policymaker trying to figure out where young Canadians will work in the future uh, needs to answer right now and we don't have that answer. Uh, we are at the beginning of a process that will lead to hopefully to, uh, to the right answers. So should Canada have an innovation policy? Absolutely. Do we have one? Not really.